Wow, my other video got 16 minutes. Okay, so this is like a part two um, to the last one I made. So, this guy, you know, irritates me still. Um, straight up lied about himself. Claimed I was fake. I'm not fake. None of me is fake. I've had two kids. Um, claimed I was fake as ever. I lied about my age. I didn't lie about my age. I just look young for my age. Uh-uh. I am 34. Um, like I said, I live here in Washington. I ain't telling you full detail, but apparently this guy wanted, uh, inappropriate pictures of me, and when I, um, um, so the guy I'm with now, I sent him pictures. Just a second. Okay. Back to what I was saying. <laughs> Um, this is kind of like a story time. So I do a lot of story times on this channel. Um, I have a hard time doing comedy because <laughs> it is very hard to do comedy with kids. So put you guys on pause again. Kind of keeps you guys in the, oh, what's going on? Okay, back to what I was saying. <laughs> So, I told the one I'm with now what had happened last year, and he couldn't do anything at the time, because we weren't fully dating. So, this other guy, he thought that we were, the other guy thought we were dating. So... Here's the twist. Um, I'll come back to the twist. Okay. <laughs> um, alright. So, the other guy thought I was dating him. So, I asked him, like a friend, and as a friend, I asked him, can you um, tell this guy to leave me alone? Place. This guy's driving me crazy. This 60-something-year-old guy kept blowing my phone up every day. He would call. He would basically text me. He wouldn't call me. He would text me. And I think it was this other guy. The guy I was, like, friends with. He kept blowing my phone up, too. So... Anyways, it was sad. It was sad. And then I blocked his number, and he would text me from a random text app number. And watching, you know, shows I watch, I caught on to the red flags at this guy, 64-year-old man, was texting me over and over again. It got weird and crazy. And so, okay, as a Christian woman, yes, I messed up and then, you know, um, Read between the lines. It was scary and horrifying because he threatened to send them, okay, send them to my family, which I didn't want then. Um, um, so. I kept telling him to please stop, leave me alone, um, don't bother me anymore, I don't want nothing to do with you. 
And then the guy that I was friends with proceeded to, um, he stopped talking to me. And then one night at 11, I think it was 1130, I was watching YouTube. And I was in the middle of watching YouTube. I was watching some comedy. <laughs> um, and uh, so apparently this um, this guy proceeded to, um, or yeah, the guy that I was friends with proceeded to, um, Tell me, um, pretty soon I gotta get dressed, because my kids are gonna be going on. So, make long story short, um, he sent me a text claiming to be his mom. That's, it was so weird. His mom. And he, you know, he threatened me and all this and that, and so on and so on. So, yeah. Anyways... I'm gonna let y'all go. I will try to do some more this afternoon before my other half comes over and does some work. Um, so today or tomorrow. Um, so yeah, talk to you guys next time. So bye. <laughs>